making a consistent characters in AI image generation is something really challenging. But it gets more challenging when it comes to AI video generation because this is something more complicated. But in this video, I'm gonna share a technique to make the consistent characters in your AI videos. So how all of these things will work? Let's find out. Okay, to make it possible, we're gonna use Moon Valley AI Video Generator. I have covered a detailed video on this AI tool and this is one of the best free AI video generators. But if you don't know how to access this AI tool, you can simply go to the moonvalley.ai and click on this try the beta and you guys will be redirected to their Discord account. So once you are on their Discord account, on the left side, you can see we have some channels. So I'm gonna select any one of them like the new Moon 5 and now here you can see we have some videos that people have generated. Now to create your own videos, you just have to type forward slash and here you have to select the create option, okay? So first of all, you have to enter the prompt. So let's say I'm gonna give the prompt like a close-up of a woman in a coffee shop, cinematic lighting, warm and cold tones, photorealistic masterpiece and then we have to select the style. So here we have five different styles, comic book, fantasy, anime, then we have the realism style and then we have the 3D animation style. So I'm gonna select the realism one because it generates some photorealistic results and then we have to select the length of the video. So I'm gonna select the medium one and here we have five different more options. First of all, we have the image option. So they recently added the image option. So it works as the image to video feature. Then we have the camera controls. You can control the camera motions and then we have the model version. So you can select the model version that we have by default selected the version two. So I'm gonna select the version two. And then we also have the option to enter the negative prompt in it. So I'm gonna leave it like this. And then we have the most important option that is seed number. So I'm gonna click on that seed number and here you have to type any random seed number if you want to get the consistent characters. So let's say I'm gonna type 136323. So you guys can enter any random seed number and now hit generate. So this process can take some time. It depends on the video duration that you have selected. So see after the results. Okay, so these are the output results and let me play this for you. Okay, so this is really smooth video. We have that character and we also have the uh, coffee shop kind of background in it. And you can also see the details, our prompt and the model that we have selected and also the seed number that we used for this video. Now, again, I'm gonna copy this prompt and this time I'm gonna make some changes in it. So again, I'm gonna type forward slash and select the create prompt and in the prompt section, I'm gonna type the same prompt and this time I'm gonna make some changes in it like a close up of a woman. Instead of a coffee shop, I'm gonna type on a street and I will add some more details like wearing leather jacket. And again, I'm gonna select the realism style and the duration time will be medium and the C number will be same like 136323. And let's hit generate. Okay, the results are ready and let me play this for you. And now look at that. We have the same character almost the same character wearing the leather jacket and we have that street kind of look in it. So if I pre uh, compare it with the previous video, so this is the previous video that we have generated. And this is the second video. Just look at that. But we are not gonna end up with that. I'm gonna take it one step further. So again, I'm gonna copy the same prompt and in the prompt section, I'm gonna type this prompt, but this time I will add some more details in it like on a street wearing jacket, wearing a leather jacket and this time I'm gonna add glasses and the rest of the prompt will be same and the style will be realism, mediums, style and the seed number will be same and let's see what it comes up with. Okay, the video is ready and let me play this for you. And now we can see this is almost the same character. I'm not saying that this is exactly the same like we have two characters in it but look at the main character. This one is exactly matching with our second video. So if I compare both of these videos side by side you can see in the first video we have a different environment like we, uh, the woman is in a coffee shop but the character looks similar to the second video but, but if we look at the second and third video we have almost the same character but we have some changes in it in the second video we have the woman without glasses and in the third video we have two characters but if we look at the main character this is almost matching with our second character and i think this is enough to make the consistent characters so that's it from this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one.